Okay, so kwenye episode hii tutaona namna kuilinki project yetu ya Django na website ya MySQL. Of course kwenye episode iliyotangulia tuliona namna kutengeneza models. Of course tulitengeneza model ya announcement, customer, employee pamoja na department, okay? Okay, so kwenye episode zizo tangulia tuliona namna ya kudownload free open source uh, bootstrap uh, website template na kuintegrate kwenye project yetu hiyo website. Of course tuli download hapa of course. Okay, so hii ni site ambayo una download uh, free bootstrap template so utakuja katika home okay so kwenye home hapa uta download hizi uh, template right okay so kisha download uh, of course itaonekana hivi hapa kabla uja customize so kisha customize kuna baza vitu utatroa itakuwa zi simple kama inafonekana hii just a simple tool so utachengeza page tatu ya kwanza ni application right okay ya pili ni login okay so una tulishi hapa kwenye episode yu utangulia kutengeza models so models inafonya kazi ya kuinteract na database ya msq Okay so now kwenye episode hii tafanya uh, tuta just ku connect ya application na database all right so akisha me download current version ya zamu as a kinyume na hapo itafanya kazi as well okay so ndakuja katika desktop start button taandika zamu control panel all right tutai click so zamu control panel tutakuwa mifungua kama hivi all right so ndio click ya patch tuta click start na me escort tuta click start okay kisha kuja hapa kwenye admin of course ta click okay so click kwenye admin itafungua php ma admin okay right so utakuja katika project right utakuja katika settings.py okay so utakuja katika database connection databases okay so kwenye databases hapa hii hapo okay so now nita delete hivyo kupo ndani okay so nitaweka hivi okay so engine natumia jango uh, back end So kwenye SQL na kwenye SQL So name will be a database name User will be for the root Password will be empty for root Hosting local host Ok And port number ni hiyo hako Kwa nitakuja kwenye PHP ma admin Ok nitakuja kwenye za new Link Ok so database name Database name will be for example my project My project Right so nita click create Ok So ndo uja katika settings Ok, database name will be my Ok, p project Ok, after then ita save changes Ok, so ndo uja katika command prompt Right, so current application yangu na run Tumweza control c Short cut ya quest of fisher kwa hivi Ok So, kina chufata ni just ku Fanya migrations Kufanya migration Ya table models of course using the models kuja katika models.py alright so models yetu ni hizi kuzifanya migrations ziende kwenye database ya scroll as well so nitakuja hapa nitaandika python okay python right so space okay manage.py then make what migration okay after that click enter to execute Make migration, make migrations, okay, yes, make migrations. Okay, migrations make a priority for a model announcement, okay, customer department, monthly installments, more than employee compensation. Okay. Right, so now, kuna hii file, nitwa migrations, niki click migrations, okay, so migration ya kwanza nitwa initial.py, so niki click, hii ni default migrations, okay. So um, kuna customer, okay, announcement, right, then, uh, state of condition ID, okay, in the department, okay, monthly installments, okay, amount current, of course, is kuna viwango vya fedha, ambavu ni hivi, so viko ndani ya models, okay. Right, now, so now, kujia katika project yangu, of course, migration do hii, mesha fanyika, okay, so now, na migrate, python manage.py, Okay, so now migrate. Migrate, right? After then I click enter to execute. Okay, migration in a qua now applied. So migration applied to up one. Up one is apple. Again to admin authentication na session. Okay. Okay, so now kaja katika database yapo. So now key fresh uh database and my project. Where is my project? Okay, so now key click. So now values in a fine migration, so 14 tables. Okay, so ngeja katika huku, badu inandia ku Fanya migrations Okay, so now migration ni mikuwa price So now, 
Unaweza kufanya migration kwa kutana na hila kusabu ya install library my scroll. So tunandika pip. Ok, now pip install what my scroll. Otherwise migration ita fail. Ok, ita shindwa connect. So kiandika pip install my scroll. Ok, so now uh, requirements misha kwa satisfied. Ok, now. Ukishandika pip install my scroll. So now unaweza kufanya migration. So wakikisha kwa kwa install your library. Kisha nduwa jufanya migrations. Ok. So when migration it fail kwa sababu install your library. So install kwanza. Okay now so ukija katika database ngije kuje refresh. Okay so now na 16 tables okay. So na one announcements, compensation, customer department employee and so on. Okay so ukija katika more kit more. So now the designer right? So when the designer hapa just ukuta relationship umesha kwa create okay relationship in table z to z ok ok so kizi ya range hapo tutajipanga vizuri <coughs> ok so now katika episode ino first wakujia kuona sasa namna ku uh, login kwenye admin panel na ku access model z to izo mba tumezitengineza ok